Good afternoon. I'm a medical student and I've been asked to examine your eyes today. Is that okay with you? Yes, that's fine. May I have your name and age, please? Tracy Smith, I'm 22 years old. Okay, Miss Smith, in this exam I'll be looking at your eyes and also coming close to you and touching your eyes. If at all you feel uncomfortable, let me know and we can stop the exam. Okay. Can you look directly at my nose, please? Yeah. On gross examination, note the presence or absence of facial symmetry, any overt strabismus, and the presence of any scars, whether traumatic or surgical. On closer inspection, again look for scars, whether traumatic or surgical, the presence of any periorbital edema, signs of inflammation such as redness or swelling. Note the eyebrows, whether they are symmetrical, any thinning, thinning on the lateral one-third aspect that could indicate thyroid pathology, any flaking that may indicate seborrheic dermatitis, and any serous, purulent, or mucoid discharge of the eyes. Okay, I'm just going to pull down on your lower eyelid, okay, and you can just look up for me. And I'm doing it on the other side. Note the presence or absence of any entropion, ectropion, and any abnormal eyelash growth or distichias. Also note whether there is any conjunctival pallor, hemorrhage, cyanosis, or icterus. Okay, I'm now going to gently evict your eyelid. It's going to feel a little uncomfortable, but it should cause you no pain. Just relax. Okay, can you look down for me, please? No the presence of any foreign body or inflammation or abnormal eyelash growth. Good. Just blink normally and it will come back in place. Was that okay? Yes. Yeah. Thank you very much. I will repeat it on the other side now. Thank you very much for cooperating with me today for this exam. Was it okay for you? Yes, it was. Thank you. You're welcome.